welcome to What's Up, I'm Joanne. If you're a Singapore International Racing Festival fan, then stay tuned to find out our latest happenings at the Roadshows. For QE2 Cup and Ladies Night followers, we keep you up to date with the latest events. Plenty of activities await you at our surf road shows. From equine exhibitions to horseshoe pitching competitions to horseshoe painting, it is definitely a fun-filled day for the entire family. Don't forget, our lovely turf belts will also be making their appearance at the road shows. It's activities galore for the family at surf road shows. Learn more about horses and get to see and touch horse racing accessories at the Equine Exhibition. I think the exhibit right, has allowed me to understand a little bit about uh, the Turf Club and its development and also about horse racing here in Singapore. Well, the exhibits are very informative. Um, they create public awareness. I'm, I'm quite surprised uh, that actually uh, Turf Club is about really, what, 170 years. Uh. Try your hand at the Horseshoe Pitching Competition. Complete the qualifying rounds to be eligible to compete at the finals and stand to win attractive prizes worth more than $4,000. When I first pass by, I know I see people doing it. I watch them play, pick up some points here and there, and I tried that. So uh, I, didn't work, I didn't work out the first time, so this is the second day I came back. So I managed to qualify for it. Get creative and design your very own horseshoe. Each session costs just $5 with all proceeds going to the club's adopted charity, Club Rainbow Singapore. What's more, you get to keep the horseshoe. Children these days don't know what horseshoes look like. This horseshoe activity right, allows them to uh, appreciate what a horseshoe looks like, what it is used for, and uh, also the $5 that uh, we pay so that they can keep the horseshoe goes a long way to helping Club Rainbow uh, support some of its activities. Meet and mingle with Mediacorp artists and the turf belts. I think the exhibits are very engaging and um, it's very, very interesting, very informative. It's a very different feel from the exhibition last year. I think it's a lot more interesting, yeah. Celebrate the Singapore International Racing Festival at our roadshows. Tap dance originated from African-American dancing and the sound is made by the metal tap on the heel and the toe of the shoe. During the recent ladies' night, guests were treated to this entertaining dance genre. QE2 Cup was actually launched to mark Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II's visit to the Singapore race course at Bukit Timah in 1972. This year, we celebrate the Queen's Diamond Jubilee which marks her 60th year of her accession to the throne. Her reign is the second longest for a British monarch after Queen Victoria. During Ladies' Night, ladies received free admission to lower and upper grandstands, while guests with a package picked up their goodie bags on their way to the marquee. With the widespread buffet and free flow of cocktails and beer, guests had a wonderful time dining in style and pampered themselves with the manicure services. They were also encouraged to put on fancy hats and participate in the Best Hat on Tracks contest and the winner walked away with a Prada bear. The winning voter also received a Ritz-Carlton dining voucher and Capita voucher. Last but not least, tap dancers entertained the crowd with their nifty moves and dazzling steps. The highlight of the night was the running of the $500,000 Group 2 Queen Elizabeth II Cup. Running on hard, New Rosewood down the outside, but Waikato's got a break over New Rosewood and Waikato takes it out. Waikato from New Rosewood. Trained by Laurie Laxon and jockeyed by Joe Morera, seasoned Waikato picked up his 19th win. It was also his first win over 2,000 metres. I hope you've enjoyed this episode of What's Up. For more information, log on to turfclub.com.sg. Bye!